decimals. Decimals is another way of representing fractions. Okay. For example, there is some water in jug. The water is poured into three mugs of one liter each. The third mug is not full as the picture shows. How much water is in the third mug? Two mugs are completely full, but third mug it is partially filled. Okay. When we represent fractional amount, we often use 1 by 10 of the original unit. 1 by 10 is nothing but 0 0.1 liter. 0 0.1. If if uh, this this comes under first division, then it is 0 0.1 liter. If the water comes to second division, it will be 0 0.2 liter. Total 1 liter is divided into 10 parts. Each part represents 1 by 10. 1 by 10 is nothing but 0 0.1 okay so 0 0.1 liter is nothing but 1 by 10 as you said earlier this is 0 0.1 liter okay and the jug is full up to first day first division first division means 0 0.1 liter if the jug fill fills up to third division then it becomes 3 by 10 3 by 10 is nothing but 0 0.3 So in the jug there are there is 2 liter and 0 0.3 liter 2 liter plus 0 0.3 is nothing but 2.3 liters numbers such as 0 0.1 0 0.3 2.3 and so on are called decimals and point is called decimal point the point in between 0 and 1 is called decimal point on the number scale this represent 1 and this represent tenths for example 2.3 2.3 this this place the place value is tenths okay place value up to is 1 place value of 3 is tenths it is called tenths place. In contrast, numbers which we have studied such as 0, 1, 2 and so on without fraction part are called integers. Okay, represent the following volumes using decimals and write it in words. This is up to 9th division. So, it is 0 0.9 liters. Okay. I am not writing the uh, unit of uh, water, okay, 0 0.9 liters, you can put L also, no problem, 1, 2, 3, 4, this one is 0 0.4 liter, 0 0.4, if you want to include the unit also, you can include the unit, this is 0 0.4 liter, next one, 1 liter plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 0 0.5. So, together 1 plus 0 0.5 is 1.5 liter. Okay. What about fourth one? Fourth one, 1, 2, 3 plus 0 0.3. So, 3.3 liter. Here L stands for liter. Classify these numbers in decimals and integers. Uh, 0 0.6 is decimal, 1.7 is decimal. Wherever there is a decimal point, uh, that number will be decimal. Okay, 11.3 is decimal, 36.8 also is decimal. It only integers are 2 and 4. How many centimeters is the length of the red tape? Started here up to fourth division after 7 right so this is 1 2 3 4 point 4 7 plus point 4 is 7.4 7 7.4 cm unit is cm okay uh, each small division is called mm millimeter 
so 7 centimeters and 4 millimeters you can place 7 here 7 centimeters and 4 millimeter 1 millimeter is 0 0.1 centimeter how many cm is 1 millimeter 0 0.1 1 by 10 or 0 0.1 centimeter how can you write 4 mm in cm 0 0.4 4 by 10 0 0.4 centimeter how can you write 7 centimeter 4 mm in cm 7.4 cm okay the weight of the oranges is 1 kilogram 500 grams how many kilograms is the weight of the oranges 500 by 1000 is, uh, is kg so 5 by 10 is nothing but 0 0.5 so 1 plus 0 0.5 1.5 1 1.5 kg how you write 100 grams in kg 0 0.1 gram sorry 0 0.1 kg 100 by 1000 since 1 kg is 1000 grams it will be 100 by 1000 so 1 by 10 1 by 10 is 0 0.1 kg remember that 1000 grams is equal to 1 kg, 1 kg that we already know how can you write 500 grams in kg 5 into 0 0.1 or 5 by 10 or 500 by 1000 whatever it may be we will get 0 0.5 kg how can you write 1 kg plus 500 grams in kg 1.5 kg okay so the answer is 1.5 kg we use decimals in many situations in our day to day life uh, let's learn more about decimals size of the decimals let's compare the size of the decimals what number are represented for a b c d on the number line a represents 0 0.1 first division there are 10 divisions from 0 to 1 it represents first division so 0 0.1 1 by 10 are nothing but 0 0.1 b represents 5 6 7 7 after 1 so 1.7 this one 2.2 .2. and this one 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 3.8 d represents 3.8 now put these numbers on the number line above 0 0.9 means here 0 0.5 here 2.6 here ok 3.2 second division after 3 so 3.2 here ok how many 0 0.1's consist in 0 0.5, 1.8, 3.3 0.5 there are 5 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 ok 1.8 1.8 into 10 that is 18 3.3 3.3 into 10 33 ok why for 0.5 we multiply it with 10 you got 5 right so there are exactly 5 0 0.1s in 0 0.5 in 1.8 we need to multiply it with 10 that is 18 here it is 33 answer the following questions uh, write the number made of 25 0 0.1s 2.5 write the number made of 20 0 0.1s 2 how many 0 0.1s make 3.2 32 how many 1s and 0 0.1s make 3.2 3 1s and 2 0 0.1s ok which is larger 2.1 or 1.3 2.1 is larger why 1.3 is here 2.1 is here 2.1 is made up of 21 0 0.1s 1.3 is made up of 13 0 0.1s so 2.1 is greater than 1.3 another way of uh, proving it ok which is larger 2.4 is larger let's use the symbol greater than and less than greater than 
2.4 is greater than 1.8 as we already know 3 is greater than 0 0.8 0 0.8 is less than 1 so 3 is greater than 1 so 3 is greater than 3 is greater than 0 0.8 7.1 6.8 7 is greater than 6 right so 7.1 is greater than 6.8 which is greater 0 or 0 0.1 0 0.1 is greater so 0 is less than 0 0.1 okay this is larger so 0 is less than 0 0.1 which is larger 2 by 10 or 0 0.3 0 0.3 is larger 0 0.3 is nothing but 3 by 10 okay denominators are equal so numerator is in the numerator 3 is more than 2 so 0 0.3 is greater than 2 by 10 2 by 10 is made up of 2 0.1s 0 0.3 is made up of 3 0.1s therefore 2 by 10 is less than 0 0.3 Another way of uh, looking at it uh, is uh, 2 by 10 is made up of 2 1 by 10, 0 0.3 is made up of 3 1 by 10. Therefore, 2 by 10 is less than 0 0.3. Let us clarify the relation between the common fractions and decimals on the number line. 0 0.1 is, is written as 1 by 10, 0 0.2 2 by 10 and so on. Which is larger represent with relation symbol. 8 by 10 is nothing but 0 0.8 is larger than 0 0.7 you can refer the number line also if you if you wish so 8 by 10 is greater than 0 0.7 0 0.3 3 by 10 equal right 3 by 10 is nothing but 0 0.3 therefore both are equal 0.1 3 by 10 which is larger 3 by 10 is larger so 0.1 is less than 3 by 10 10 by 10 0.9 10 by 10 is nothing but 1 1 is greater than 0 0.9 you can refer number line as well 10 by 10 is here 9 by 10 or 0.9 is here so 10 by 10 is greater than 0 0.9 9. We'll stop it here. Uh, we'll discuss the next topic in the next session. Okay. Thank you.